with the video. Is why are you doing it? So can yeah. you explain why why go through this whole process? Yes. Yeah, so um, as the name suggests, it's an upgrade. So it's literally uh, new contracts and uh, some kind of a, a, a migration scheme to get those new tokens. Um, there's a, a few reasons. One is the kind of the technical reason we wanted to uh, update our contracts. The original CDT contracts were written in early 2017. Uh, and of course, they are non, uh, you, you cannot change them, you cannot upgrade them. And so um, I think it's a good time to do so after uh, four years, uh, even more so. I think it's important. Uh, a lot of the ERC-20 and other standards uh, came a long way since then. So I think it's, that's that's one uh, part. Of course, you always have the name, right? You have the, you want to have the, the correct name for the correct product. And so SSV uh, changing the symbol for the token is, is uh, pretty cool as well. And the third part is that um, the token and uh, the ability to mint new tokens um, under the control of the DAO uh, doesn't exist in the, in the CDT uh, smart contract. And so all of those reasons uh, led us to make the upgrade. Um, also, we wanted to reduce the decimal points, the decimal precision precision for the, uh, uh, sorry, not the decimal precision, the, the amount of to circulating tokens, which will uh, change the decimal precision uh, needed uh, to represent one token against Ethereum or whatever. Um, and so all of the reasons, those reasons are really what uh, drove us to make a new contract. Um, and it's an upgrade, which means basically that anyone who's holding CDT uh, converts uh, on chain uh, whenever they want to SSV. There's a fixed um, conversion rate, uh, 1 to 100. So for every 100 CDT, you'll get one SSV. Uh, and that's for everyone. It doesn't, you know, it doesn't change with time or anything. It's a fixed ratio. Um, and so we'll also be moving from 1 billion um, circulating supply to uh, 10 million. Um, and so th those are kind of the, I guess, the main points um, in terms of uh, when it will happen. So we, we've uploaded the, the proposal to the form, I guess, two or three weeks ago. And uh, hopefully in the next one or two weeks, we'll get the proposal on uh, the snapshot um, page in order to actually vote. And the voting is done with CDT. Um, and so CDT holders vote to upgrade to SSV token. And if that passes, then uh, SSV tokens will be, um, will, will deploy the, um, the SSV token with the conversion contract. And then anyone can uh, from that moment on uh, convert to SSV. Yep. Yeah.